Back here tonight at 6 o'clock on a Monday, well tonight Dubuque City leaders are going to be discussing whether to permanently a close a local railroad crossing, part of their quiet zone plan. KWW Dubuque reporter Tara Konishny explains what's behind this new conversation. The Dubuque City Council will make a decision tonight on whether they approve the permanent closure of the 15th Street at grade railroad crossing for safety reasons, as well as creating a railroad quiet zone for residents and businesses who live nearby. The railroad quiet zone will implement that trains will not be required to blow their horns when they approach an at grade crossing because of the updated warnings and barriers at the crossing. The closure is financially supported by the railroad company Canadian Pacific Kansas City Limited Railroad offering $100,000 compensation and assistance for safety improvement projects at other crossings in the city. Once the crossing's closed, there's zero chance of ever a car colliding with a train. That helps our overall downtown safety rating, and that increases our ability to go ahead in uh, the next few years after we make additional safety improvements to uh, apply for that railroad quiet zone status. There has been public opinions heard on the matter for those who live or work near the crossing, and it has had a majority support in the closure of it. A survey was also conducted in the community on how the train noise disrupts quality of life and property values. Of 479 surveys, 73% said it bothered them. Plans are underway for a new infrastructure project for the 14th Street overpass bridge to keep pedestrians and traffic moving when a train is coming through. In Dubuque, Tara Konichny, New 7 KWWL.